Hello friends, today we will be doing Math Kangaroo Level 5 and 6, uh, year 2024, question number 17. This is a four-point problem. Let's read the question. The figure below shows a honeycomb with 16 cells. Some of the cells contain honey. The number in each cell indicates how many of its neighboring cells contain honey. Two cells are neighbors if they, sh if they share a common edge. Common edge means this. Like, let me just change the color. It means this edge. Okay, not the corners, but the edge. How many cells in the honeycomb contain honey? So, which of these cells contain honey? Now, we need a starting point. Like, for example, if this says zero, that means none of these two cells contain honey. Right? So, these two do not contain honey. Now, uh. So now we just need to find uh, a cell which is like for example let's just start with four because it has four neighboring cells so all four of them will have honey because it has four uh, neighboring cells so let's just mark the ones which have honey with red so this has honey this has honey this has honey and this has honey correct now this is the starting point now if you if you see this is one so only one of them has honey, which is already here. Four has honey. So that means this one doesn't have honey. This one doesn't have honey. Okay. Now, similarly, if you see this one, so only one of the neighboring cells have honey. So that means two has it. So this three doesn't have honey. But uh, if we're talking about this three, so that means this two will have honey so that these three uh not this two, sorry. So if we are talking about this two, so this one has honey, this one has honey. Now we are talking about this three. So all these three are having honey. So that means this two is not having honey, right? Now, when we are talking about, uh, so now let's look here out of these, how many will have honey? Now, if we are talking about, say this three, like if you see here, the number was three. Now, this one doesn't have honey. So, this one has honey. This one has honey. So, that means this one has honey. Okay. And now, if you're talking about this three. So, the neighboring cells to this is this, this, this are not having honey. This one has honey. Okay. So, then this has to have honey and this has to have honey. So, all three are having honey. And now, if we talk about, uh, say, this four. So, one, two, three, four are having honey. So, that means this one will not have honey. Now, if you see here, uh, this, it's saying three. Okay, so only two of the cells are having honey. Similarly, here they're saying two. Only one of them is having honey. So that means this cell also has honey. So now, out of 16, let's just see how many of them are having honey. So, or we can just, out of 16, how many of them do not have honey is one, two, three, four, five is 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 7 of them do not have honey. So that means 9 have honey. So my answer to this question is option C. I hope you like this video. Do subscribe to my channel for more such videos. Thank you for watching.